Hi everyone, I'm here again with Nicole, the gut girl. Thanks for being here, Nicole. Absolutely. Thank you for having me. All right. So as you know, Nicole is a nutritionist, can help you with uh, reading blood work. And if you're having a really hard time losing weight, um, you've tried all the basics and it's not working, you might want to reach out to Nicole. So we're going to talk about lutein. What is it, Nicole? Okay, so lutein is an antioxidant and it's part of the um, carotenoid family. Sorry, mutilated that. Um, but it's what gives fruit the color, like the vibrant reds, blues, I mean blues, I'm doing good today. Greens, yellows. Um, and it, the one thing that you always think of lutein for is eye care. And it is very good for your eye care, your eye health, anyone who is you know, losing their eyesight or, you know, aging and losing it, you should be having a lot of lutein in your life to help prevent that. Um, it blocks harmful light from the sun, from it, our screens, from our phones, from all of that kind of stuff. It also prevents macular degeneration, which is really rampant in as we get older. But some of the things you don't know about lutein is it helps brain tissue. It's really good for that. It helps diabetic retinopathy. And it also, this is the one that has, has surprised me about lutein that most people do not know. It helps reduce LDLs by promoting your HDLs, which is good cholesterol. LDL is what, what creates plaque. HDL is what helps bring that down. Also helps with your hormones. So it's a really, really good thing to have if you have high cholesterol LDLs. And a lot of times I see in blood work, high LDLs, low HDLs, which then I can always assume there's going to be some kind of hormone issues. But what it does is it sends the LDL particles into the liver to be removed. So it's really, really beneficial nutrient to get in the body, but where you can get this is um, through leafy greens, parsley, broccoli, egg yolks, my favorite. I have eggs all the time, but I always make sure the yolks are in it. Squash, red grapes have them. Um, you don't also want to be going and eating a ton of red grapes because they're really high in sugar um, insulin spiking, but um, red peppers and kiwis. Kiwis are really packed with lutein. What about tomatoes? Yes, definitely. But they have more lycopene than they do lutein. So. Okay. So, um, fruits and vegetables, basically. Yes. Yeah. What about in supplement form? Do you know of any supplement form or yeah. can you get it like that? Yeah. And you can get it, um, in any kind of supplement form. I usually, if I'm going to do a, uh, um, uh, supplement of it, I'm going to do 500 milligrams of it a day. Hmm. And you can get that pretty much you can anywhere. You get that anywhere. I would prefer you don't get that at big box stores. I prefer you get it, you know, have done your due diligence and looked at, at your different supplements, make sure there's no fillers, hidden glutens, any of that kind of stuff. Okay, everybody. Lutein. That's our lesson for today on the benefits of lutein. Um, and that's, it, it's surprising. And you know, if you just eat healthy, it's going to make a difference, yep. right? It sure You're is. You're eating good. fruits and vegetables and eggs. I mean, come on. Every time we talk about eggs, it's got whatever positive nutrient. nutrient. It's in the yes. egg. It's always in the egg. <laughs> always in right? the egg yolk, yes. <laughs> right. So, Nicole, um, I know you'll give uh, our listeners $100 off your program if they mention that they heard us talking. Um, so... How do they get a hold of you? You can reach me at the email, thegutgirl1 at gmail.com. And I'll be happy you mention this video or any of the other videos we've done together. And I will give you $100 off the program. Okay. That makes me feel popular. <laughs> me too. All right. Okay. Thanks for being with us, Nicole. We'll talk to you next time. Thank you.